We're so happy to have you all. Mehnoush, Reza, Mojde, and Zara. Thank you for sending us your film. My first question is, have you met people like the characters in the story? The idea of the film was from Mehnoush, and we as actors tried to improve it. When Mehnoush came to talk about the character which I played her role, I asked her, what have you seen between me and her? And she said, when I see you, you remind me that character. At first, the story was a bit different from what you have seen. We all talked about it a lot. And the final idea that got shot come from some meetings. We had some rehearsals that helped each character to become more clear. When I was writing the screenplay, I couldn't think about anyone except these three leading characters. I could not replace someone instead of Zara or Reza. They became co-storytellers for this film. The first character that Mehnush wrote was a drummer. When she suggested that character to me, I started practicing drumming for two, three months. I was even dreaming this rhythm, even night. Dum dum da, dum dum da. Then Mehnush told me that the character has been changed. And when she about the new character, it was really hard for me to find someone like him in the real world. I was really confused and I didn't know what would happen. As an actor, I always try to find someone in real life close to the characters that I want to play. I searched a lot to find someone like the character in the film America. I was finally able to locate someone who had this exact experience. He was hospitalized at Ruzbe Hospital in Tehran a facility for people with mental disorders. I spent a lot of time with him and I found that he was there because he lost his job, not because he's, he lost the love of his life. But he was actually married to his job and when he found that his colleague you left him, he lost his mind. I tried my best to find someone crossover points with him and the character and I think I did it. How about you, Mujde? I have never tried to find someone in the real world with similar traits and personality as the character I want to play. When Mehnush suggested this role to me, I tried to find something inside myself. For example, if we attempt to explain the character of a mother and the concept in Iranian cinema or world cinema, the mother is a symbol of sacrifice and forgiveness. But the character that Mehnush suggested to me was a strange and filled with turmoil. She was not like any other mothers that I have seen it before. I was unable to find a good example of this character in my life. I wish to add something in line with the story that Reza said about the drummer. The first idea of the film came from a story that happened with a rock group called Yellow Dogs, but decided to illustrate a character who feels they are missing an important event. It does not matter if it's real or not, the person or character just feels like they missed something. I also wanted to juxtapose this turmoil between this man and his family who are living in a better situation away from him alongside his wife who is improving and moving towards greater success step by step. I want the audience to feel this feeling of missing and turmoil that the character lives with. And that was the point of the film. Zara, can you tell us more about it? This feeling of missing something is counting in everyday life in Iran. You can add war and sanctions to it. We always live with these stresses that we are going to miss our big chance. You should move. You should immigrate. What should I do? We also commonly are told, if you are come to this side or immigrate here, try your luck. 
The result of these pressures and situations is that you always feel lost. You always think about the place that is not here, is not Iran, and you feel like you missed something to leave it. Also, when you immigrate, you have the same feeling of missing your hometown. Then you still miss a lot of things. You feel lost again. The missing something is on both sides for a person who could not migrate and for a person who could. So, welcome. so welcome to my world. From the time that Mehnush immigrates, always when I talk to her, I feel she also missed a lot of things. She has missed walking in Tehran's streets with us. She missed walking and smoking in front of the bookshops in Engelab Street with us. She missed a lot of pleasures that she engaged in in Iran. One more point about the main characters, we wanted them to be renters of the house, not the owners. And any time the owner comes back, they could lose this place. Even in this unsustainable situation, the wife decides to immigrate. She was successful, but others not. The point of it was conveying the potential to even lose their land. How about you, Reza? From early age at the school or even work, you always feel that you cannot achieve. In every step of life, you feel that. That's why the idea of immigrating to America or any other first world land is so strong. It's so different from the place that you are living now. You feel like there you will have more rights and opportunities. And then the character sees many reasons can be used that your wife could immigrate and you cannot. I have to mention that I really love the position and the character of the sister in the film. In her phone conversation with her brother, when she tells her brother, it's okay, come back, even if you were not successful, it's okay, come back to us. I'm not angry that just Iranians are suffering, and I'm not saying people in other countries are not suffering. But I can say that people who live in Iran have a kind of turmoil and ongoing stress. And when I saw the screenplay, I was like, okay, I just can't play the role by relying on that turmoil.